mister. There's a package for you. Who's it from? Um, how should I know? So the guy would be ten bucks to bring this package to the store. There could be a bomb in there. They give me a package and you don't know who gave it to you? Give me ten bucks and I'll make something up. Oh no, I'm fine. Thanks. Fine. Suit yourself. Whole package for the man with the glasses and tattoo on his right wrist. He'll arrive within the hour. Do not give to anyone else and do not open. There's a device on the box. We'll know if you do. Payment if pickup is successful. What? Oh, what's that? It's a package. Thank you, James. I meant what's in it. How should I know, Terry? It just got here. And apparently I'm not supposed to open it. Why are you here? Your curiosity, I guess. I don't know, man. It looks kind of suspicious to me. Relax, man. It's just a package. And according to this note, I just have to hold on until some geek with glasses shows up. Then I get paid. Or an epi. Well, let's see. A package with unknown contents, given to you by an unknown sender, to be picked up by an unknown man? <laughs> yeah, no worries there. <laughs> At least you get paid for it, unlike that imaginary John Rubio set you up with. <laughs> yeah, he set me up with a real job, right? Yeah, no. I just don't know what it is and when I start. And anyway, you of all people should be able to appreciate that. An imaginary job to go along with my imaginary friend. Oh, I'm imaginary. We both know I'm not imaginary, James. And you only say things like that to hurt my feelings. How many times do I have to tell you? I wouldn't even be here if you didn't want me to be. I'm a part of you. And I know you want to open up that package. I know you do. Would you shut up about the stupid Fine, package? fine. I won't say nothing about it again. Hey, I think you should open it. Come on, man. You say it yourself. It could be a bomb in it. Right, and if I do open it, what do you think is going to happen? Good point. But hell, these fools come here and deserve our sleep for this. We're entitled to it. It could be dangerous. And if it is dangerous, maybe I don't want to know what's in it. See, so yes, that's the guy. Piece of cake. Hey, man. Got your package. I was afraid you wouldn't show up for hours, but here you are. To be honest, I don't even know why this came, but it showed up. Stop. What? Something wrong with this picture? No, this is the guy. Look closer, genius. Hey, buddy. Can I have my package? The tattoo. It's on the left. Oh, yeah. Well, so what? Maybe they had their info wrong. You think these guys give specific instructions and get the information wrong? Think. And look at this. Oh shit. Yo, I need to take this back because something else came with the package, so no. give me my package. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I told you. What would you do without me? I bet you want to know what's in this box now, don't you? Yeah, I do. Just a test. And you passed. What? But, but I opened it. Everybody opens a package. But you, you were willing to put your life in danger without even knowing what was in it first. You paid attention. And you didn't give it to the wrong guy. We need somebody like you. Nice. Jackie. I still don't understand. Who, who are you? You can thank your friend Rubio for the job. And there'll be another package here to be picked up in two days. Oh, and James? Don't open it. <laughs> I'm serious. <laughs>